Hello everybody, I'm doing this video just to debunk this new uh, savior of the sheeple. The sheeple think that they got uh, their savior, finally, that will uh, tell to the world uh, what's really uh, behind all this hoax you know, and everything. But here's a member of the European Parliament and uh, here, here is his name. He is a member, a member, a dick of the European Parliament. And his name, he is a Christian, you know. Tarhas. So let's see who is Tarhas, guys, just by doing a quick research, guys. But the sheeple do not have the time to do some quick research. They just want someone to tell them that he's saving them, you know. And here it is, you know, it's it's easy. You just have to to do some post on Facebook uh, where where some 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 savior, let me show you. Here, here it is, the, the dumb sheeple here in Italy, guys. They are all excited, guys. They are saying oh i am so excited it's beautiful we are you know creating a, an earthquake uh with this guy here which is a, a reptilian here in the european parliament control the position guys but the more do not get it of course uh i, I would like you know this guy surely is like another moron that uh, has a thousand of fo followers and he tells to them i would like to give to to each of you two roses one white and one red roses you know a rose will see later what they what they mean you know but for some of you that have a brain you already know you know the rosicrucian and everything you know the five petals of the rose you know and uh, this guy is a member a member of the christian democratic national peasants party guys i mean this is pure comedy guys you cannot have the word uh, christian and uh, and, and democracy at the same, you know, at the same place, because democracy is, uh, we know, uh, it's a hidden word for uh, communism. So Christian and communism uh, surely have some problems with each other. I lived in Albania and uh, we could not uh, have churches there in Albania because we were living in communism until the 90s. And then, uh, and it's beautiful, this last part, National Peasants Party, guys! <laughs> The slaves party, you know, peasants, you know, just like uh, a communist party would use this this uh, keyword names, you know. So let's see more of, uh, from where this guy just by putting his name on uh, on Google, guys, you get just easy stuff, you know. Uh, he studied journalism in uh, in a college in California, so my alarm starts to to ring, you know, and became a clergyman. Uh, and uh, work as a business analyst also, oh, beautiful. So let's see now the motto of this uh, university of his. Uh, what says this motto? This motto says, our tradition shines together with the European values. With new, new order, order values. Again, just keywords, if you put the university in Google and go to the, to the link that it will give to you, you will see uh, the if you search for the keyword uh, Jesuit uh, in the text, you will the alarm will go crazy because you will see it everywhere. And uh, here you can see that uh, the, the in fifty seventy eight in Romania, the Prince of Transylvania, Stefan Bathory, requested permission from Pope, from the Pope Gregory Thirteenth, Thirteenth. Uh, to establish a Jesuit college. Uh, so let me go ahead and, and, and this uh, college was carried uninterrupted for, uh, but with a brief hiatus, a brief pause until around 1607 when the Jesuits were banned because they are bad, bad boys from Romania. But now they control all the world so nobody can ban them anymore. They are everywhere. And here, here is in, in uh, uh, ah, beautiful with the logo of the United uh, uh, Government, you know, the the Phoenix there, ah, giving him this and that. But then he was kicked off because he was uh, he, he was a bad boy because they gave when he was a priest in uh, in America, uh, they gave him uh, he, he was of course to be to have a church and organization, he had to open a five hundred one, you know, uh, so that you know he cannot pay taxes and. Uh, and make money in an indirect uh, way, you know. Uh, but they kicked him out because he was spewing uh, political stuff, you know, as the Jesuits, you know, controlling the world, want to do, you know. 
I mean, Jesus is controlling the world. I mean, who, who demons are controlling? I don't know who's controlling the world, guys. But I'm just, you know, he was kicked out of uh, of there because he was uh, talking politics. But uh, of course, when you have a church, you cannot do that. And uh, here's some memes that you can find online of him. Uh, he, the, the, this one is in Romanian, but basically says he's a demon. Uh, he fooled the people uh, that was were following him by going and being a member of this party. Uh, which is a communist party, you know. Uh, priest, uh, the, uh, this is the name of this guy, the priest who gave the, uh, the service of God to that of the, you know, the demons of the party there, yeah. And this is the logo of the <coughs> PTSD party, Social Democratic Party, you know, the communism in disguise, guys, you know. So this guy that had this website uh, debunking this 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 guy, says, I asked Terrence directly if he intended to run politically after I had discussion with someone who suspected him of lying and manipulating through his actions. Terrence denied to me uh, that, that he had political int intentions. Well, this is translated by, by uh, uh, Google, guys, so it's not perfect. Now I realize that it was just the beginning of a series of lies because since 2014 he Reduced to that organization in California, he was obviously following his entry into politics for some years uh, now. Oops, uh, Christian, uh, he been, you know, he has uh, been intensively preparing his ground political chair, large using unscrupulously the church and uh, priestly robe to appear on television or to be an entourage of politician and to use the rest of us uh, to use uh, for credibility, you know. So. Uh, just by looking at some pictures now guys you can tell who this guy is you know because uh, in my opinion you know when I see someone with the suit and tie and, uh, and uh, the media around him you know I just see my eyes you know that I have the, the they leave you know glasses you know I see a piece of shit there guys a demon uh, but uh, unfortunately the dumb sheeple since they really want someone to, to do the job for them they see them this guy as a hero as a lovely hero, look at look at this guy. But surely he's uh, of, of the sheep, guys. You can tell by the pictures and hanging around with people like this that that, that are uh, what is this guy? Anyway, uh, and, and 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 hangs out with uh, with uh, Trump and uh, and his buddies, you know. And he is the new hero, you know. They are, they have studied in the same schools, guys, and they are fooling the sheep. But they are in the job of fooling the dumb sheep with the suit and tie. It just takes a suit and tie to the for the dumb sheep was to fall in their traps, guys, and a smile, and you know, that, that, that's all, you know. And uh, here's the guy, of course, uh, believes in the invisible enemy and is helping people, poor people, left and right, with a muzzle, of course, everywhere he goes. And uh, in the background, you can see Isis and Horus because he is, uh, of course, on your side. And here is how he's working endlessly all the time in the streets uh, with, with, with people around him try, he's trying to see where the problems are and trying to be with the sheep and to try and to well, here's he's a product of course you know he's a product like every other product here but unfortunately the dumb sheep cannot have, do not have eyes you see and, and at this point guys we can just laugh at all this this is pure comedy guys here's here's the the, the clowns here uh, hanging out you know the, here's here it is again hanging out with people with uh, lots of makeup and and dr uh, fancy dresses like this and and beautiful people like this you know and 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 that's like this guys yeah? you can tell these are beautiful people guys and their organization is with the the ones oh, uh, the old cni it's beautiful Be these are beautiful poor people humble people just working for you very hard you can see they are all sweating and and, and working hard for you okay dumb shiva here you can see that he's a hard working man guys just by looking at some and some pictures you can tell he's a good guy man look at this man look look at this look, look at this look at this this is a flag for you dumb sheep oh. here's the the name of the party the motto of the uh, of this beautiful party of his that put him in the in the in the european parliament uh, the motto of this party is uh, of course in Romania, a uh, reborn for Romania and uh, with those that have eyes to see guys the, the word reborn has some meaning but of course for the dumb sheep that uh, do not want, I don't want to give a damn about deeper meanings guys 
uh, they tell you that um, he is his our saviors. But, uh, but one girl in Facebook, which is the same girl that I was talking about you in uh, my la latest video, he, she tells me, ah, but you don't understand, you have to go deeper. This is God that is pushing them to tell the truth. That's why it's happening. But I told her, but uh, how come you are still, you know, uh, uh, still have to wear the muzzle to go to, to eat something? And, and still have to put the muzzle and take the juice to, to, to work so that you can hit something? And, uh, and how come these people, uh, uh, because she told me, no, they are, you don't understand. They are asking for gifts publicly for what they have done. And I told her, but if they really had fear of uh, God, you know, they would not uh, do this uh, publicly. They would just do it by themselves, you know, in the room where uh, there's only them and God, you know. And uh, they would ask forgiveness without cameras, and without uh, having to put a suit and tie and everything. Uh, the truth is simple, you don't have to put a suit and tie, you know, Jesus didn't uh, went around with suit and tie to, to tell the truth, you know, the truth was powerful enough, you know, uh, but, but unfortunately, these are, and these are Christian guys that fall for these guys, and this is the sad thing about all this. Okay guys, see you on the next one.